I have something very important that I gotta say to you, but before I forget, I want you to know if there are any technical difficulties, Blake tried to fix them. He tried his very best to fix them. Hi, guys. Never thank me for this video, there is no need to. Never thank me for this video, there is no need to. But please help me get it as many views as possible. Thank you, I would really appreciate that. After the commandments and doctrines of men, which things have indeed a show of wisdom in will worship and humility and neglecting of the body, not in any honor to the satisfying of the flesh. Chapter 3 If ye then be risen with Christ, seek those things which are above, where Christ sitteth on the right hand of God. Set your affection on things above, not on things on the earth. For ye are dead, and your life is hid with Christ in God. When Christ, who is our life, shall appear, then shall ye also appear with him in glory. Mortify therefore your members which are upon the earth, fornication, uncleanness, inordinate affection, evil concupiscence, and covetousness, which is idolatry. 
for which things sake the wrath of God cometh on the children of disobedience, in the which ye also walk some time, when ye lived in them. But now ye also put off all these, anger, wrath, malice, blasphemy, filthy communication out of your mouth. Lie not one to another, seeing that ye have put off the old man with his deeds, and have put on the new man, which is renewed in knowledge after the image of him that created him, where there is neither Greek nor Jew, circumcision nor uncircumcision, barbarian, Scythian, bond nor free, but Christ is all and in all. Put on, therefore, as the elect of God, holy and beloved, bowels of mercies, kindness, humbleness of mind, meekness, long-suffering, forbearing one another and forgiving one another if any man have a quarrel against any. Even as Christ forgave you, so also do ye. And above all these things put as I ought to speak. Walk in wisdom toward them that are without, redeeming the time. Let your speech be alway with grace, seasoned with salt, that ye may know how ye ought to answer every man. All my state shall Tychicus declare unto you, who is a beloved brother and a faithful minister and fellow servant in the Lord. I have given him for a witness to the people, a leader and commander to the people. Behold, thou shalt call a nation that thou knowest not, and nations that knew not thee shall run unto thee because of the Lord thy God, and for the Holy One of Israel, for he hath glorified thee. Seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Call ye upon him while he is near. Let the wicked forsake his way, and the unrighteous man his thoughts, and let him return unto the Lord, and he will have mercy upon him, and to our God, for he will abundantly pardon. For my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are your ways my ways, saith the Lord. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. For as the rain cometh down, and the snow from heaven, and returneth not thither, but watereth the earth, and maketh it bring forth and bud, that it may give seed to the sower, and bread to the eater, so shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void, but it shall accomplish that which I please, and it shall prosper in the thing whereto I sent it. Good, right? And I'll tell you, when, when we come to the, to the Lord in praise and worship, it's, it's not just an outward thing that we do. It's a heart thing. You say, well, Pastor Bob, I see that you're a really exuberant guy, and you're kind of loud, and you move around a lot, and I'm not that way. I've got dignity. Okay, that's cool. I don't, it doesn't matter. Just praise Him when your heart. Use your voice. You can, you can speak softly. You don't have to be like me. You don't have to wave your arms and get excited and jump up. You don't have to do any of those things. But the most important thing is that you're sincerely worshiping the Lord. How many of you agree with that? Sincerely love Him. Sincerely give Him praise. Amen. Amen. It's not just a tradition. It's not just something that we do because we need to kind of tip our hat to God. Amen. Answeredst them, O Lord our God. Thou wast a God that forgavest them, though thou tookest vengeance of their inventions. Exalt the Lord our God, and worship at his holy hill. For the Lord our God is holy. Psalm 100 A Psalm of Praise Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know ye that the Lord he is God. It is he that hath made us, and not we ourselves. We are his people, and the sheep of his pasture. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving, and into his courts with praise. Be thankful unto him, and bless his name. For the Lord is good, his mercy is everlasting, and his truth endureth to all generations. Psalm 101, a psalm of David. Well, did Isaiah prophesy of you, saying, This people draw me hypocrites. 
and honor not his father or his mother, he shall be free. Thus have ye made the commandment of God of none effect by your tradition. Ye hypocrites! Well did Isaiah prophesy of you, saying, This people draweth nigh unto me with their mouth, and honoreth me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. But in vain they do worship me, teaching for doctrines the commandments of men. And he called the multitude, and said unto them, Hear, and understand. Not that which goeth into the mouth defileth a man, but that which cometh out of the mouth, this defileth a man. Then came his disciples, and said unto him, Knowest thou that the Pharisees were offended after they heard this saying? But he answered and said, Every plant which my heavenly Father hath not planted shall be rooted up. Let them alone. They be blind leaders of the blind, and if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into the ditch. Then answered Peter, and said unto him, Declare unto us this parable. And Jesus said, Are ye also yet without understanding? Do not ye yet understand that whatsoever entereth in at the mouth goeth into the belly, and is cast out into the draught? But those things which proceed out of the mouth come forth from the heart, and they defile the man. For out of the heart proceed evil thoughts, murders, adulteries, fornications, thefts, false witness, blasphemies. These are the things which defile a man. But to eat with unwashen hands defileth not a man. Then Jesus went thence and... Heavenly Father, I confess my sins. I forgive all those that have sinned against me. I release all, all anger, bad feelings, resentment, and every other wrong attitude, feeling, and, and uh, emotion. Lord, Lord, I ask you to help myself and every Christian. Help us to always want to forsake and turn away from everything that would make us want to turn away from you. Help us to think only about you, and help us to forsake everything that would make us want to turn away from you. And Lord, please help, please help your people to remember that there is no need to thank me for this video. I ask this for myself and and all of your people in, in, in Jesus' holy name. Lord, thank you. Amen. Um, uh, hello, hello, YouTube, YouTube viewers. This video is nowhere near over, but I just wanted to tell you, if you watch the video, and the screen gets smaller, that's because on the day that I started it, I just got my brand new Xbox remote in that I've been waiting for for over two weeks, and, and I'm thinking about making making a YouTube video of, of Minecraft, but in order to do that, I'd probably have to send this video from my iPad to my iPhone, and then finish it on my iPhone. So I just wanted to tell you, if the screen gets all black during the video, uh, uh, unless I say otherwise, please assume that's why. Thank you.